Alright everybody, here's how to do a cord blood workup. So you get a specimen um, in a red top tube, you want to take an aliquot out, and you want to uh, wash that four times. Morton's jelly can cause a problem um, in reactions. Um, and you'll notice here I only have tubes set up for A, B, and D anti -sera. Um We're only doing a front type. Babies don't um, have their own back type as of yet. Um, you want to make a nice uh, cell suspension. Um, and add a drop of each into each tube. And then over here, we have a DAT tube and a QC um, for the DAT tube. Um, so what's gonna happen is you're gonna take some of that wash cell suspension, you're gonna put it in here. This we're gonna wash another four times because we want a dry cell button to start our DAT. You start with a, a polyspecific, um, just plain DAT, um, where we're going to see if it's positive. If it's positive, then we have to do a differential DAT, um, which is where we run um, anti-sera against IgG and complement to see what is causing the positive DAT. So here we've added a drop of each of these reagents and a drop of cells. Mix it up, and you're going to centrifuge it. Let's get up. Make sure you balance your centrifuge. It's always important. And here we go. And spin for 15 seconds. And then after this spins, what we'll do is we'll wash the um, DAT uh, tube and the DAT control tube. And then I'll show you a separate video on how to um, read that. Uh, but once this is done, so if you're just a little loud, it's going to need a little service, I think. Uh, once this is done, take it out and I'll show you how to read it. And again, it's just a front type. Um, no reverse type again, because we don't have the uh, appropriate uh, antibodies when we're born. So we're going to just tilt, jiggle. And tilt and tilt. So you want to make sure that the cell button is completely resuspended, and in this case it is. So in this patient is not A. And B. sometimes the cord bloods look a little stickier than a regular type. No B. So it's looking like this patient, this baby is O. And RH. And we have completely resuspended this cell button. Oh yeah. Nice O pause. Okay, so this baby is O-pause. There's a nice 4-plus reaction right there. You can see that cell button completely free-floating. So if I can get you a little closer. See? Beautiful little flag. Right? Okay. And now, we'll take our DAT. And we're going to balance it. Put it in 